Let's holla, man. Oh, yeah. HD FHO shirt with the FHO shirt. Oh, let me put on my seatbelt. Y'all, let me put on my seatbelt. Hold on. What up, Mona? How much gas I got? Miss Broadus, what up? Ball here, true. All right, today, man, we're going to talk about men and women, man. Over the last couple of weeks, I've had some interesting conversations about man law versus woman law. Donnie Clark, what up with it? Ava, what up, sis? Ain't T the governor, what's going on? She, my, Ava is my sister, my auntie, the governor of the 78 nation, the 48 nation, so... Trust me, she don't play no games. Rob, what up with it? Hey, I'm telling you, Toy, this shit finna get real, 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 uh, real spiffy right now. All right, listen. So over the last couple of weeks, man, I got some some cool friends, man. We've been going through. What up, uh, Daddy Daniels, Terry Campbell? What up? We've been having some real powwow type discussions. Uh, one of the things I want y'all to know is this: when you're in a marriage and a relationship, technically. Queen friends are supposed to be my friends, and my friends are supposed to be queen friends, etc., etc., etc. We have no individual friends, male or females. Um, so that that was a, a a rule or a law that was brought up. Mind you, Queen has a past. She's from Georgia, so she knows a lot of people here in Georgia that I don't know. And she was the one that introduced me to the bike set, the whole nine yards. Even though I am now the bike set guru, and she's still just Queen. You feel what I'm saying? But anyway, we've been having a lot of discussions. Me, her, me, some of my partners. And today's discussion is this. Okay. If if you have somebody that you know of, okay, that's of the opposite sex, and they're dating somebody that you that you know, that you know, okay, and you know something about that person that they don't know. And as your friend, and this is somebody, let's just say, and I'm going to use this as an example. Again, these are no actual factuals. We're just using theory, okay? What up, Angela? These are, these are theory. So this doesn't apply to my life, any of my friends directly, or anything like that. So let's get that straight. You know, I got to always put my disclaimer out there because somebody be done swore to God I'm talking about them. All right? What up, Angela? Exquisitely. The woman that only can, uh, she don't never call me back. Good morning, Nana's. I need to go by there and get me something to eat, man. Nana's chicken and waffles, man. Fuck with it. And Conyers. All right, so listen. This is it. What up, Roy? So this is what it is. What up, Richard? Okay, let's just say as a male, you know a female that you grew up with in junior high school, elementary, elementary, junior high school, high school. Now you're on the bike set and you're doing your thing. You know, you're grown now. You're 40 years old. And this person, like I said, you've been knowing them basically, you know, since school. And you find out that they're dating somebody on the bike set. But the person on the bike set, you only know of. And, you know, the person that you, you know, that you grew up with, y'all kind of cool. Y'all decent. Y'all got a cool relationship. So, you know something about the person on the bike set that the person that you cool, that you grew up with don't know. And they're in a, re and they're, they're in a relationship, a committed relationship. And they ask you about the person on the bike set or do you you know as my friend you know do you know anything about him and, and you know how much of that how much are we obligated to to tell like for example as, as if you are my friend where does and, and i guess so the, today's topic is how much of friends how much of this friendship shit is actually you know what are the boundaries of the friendship okay and what of it is mind, you know, mind your business and the whole nine yards or how much of it do you use to protect your friend? Mind your fucking business. That's what I'm talking about, Toya. Okay. So, Toya, if you don't mind, I'm going to use you. So, me and you grew up together. We high school friends and all this. And we got a re we real cool. I mean, we real cool. And I'm going to even put this in there. Me and you might have, you know, semi-fucked around in high school. You know, some kid shit. You know, some... Hide and go seek type shit. If y'all know anything about most of y'all motherfuckers don't know nothing about no hide and go seek. You know what I'm talking about? Well, we used to call it hide and go get it. You know what I'm talking about? Back in the day, man. You know what I'm talking about? I ain't gonna tell I ain't gonna say no names of who all played hide and go get it that I grew up with. But we used to play we used to play hide and go get it. Okay, I got you toy. You're gonna be good for this one. Let's go. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna get Toya in on this one. Okay. 
But we used to play hide and go get it. So let's just say, Tony, me and you grew up, and we used to play hide and go get it. We cool. So now, you know, we 40, 45 years old, and later, and now I find out that you're in love, or that you date somebody on the bike set, but I know something about them that can be pertinent to you and your relationship. You feel what I'm saying? Is my loyalty to you more important than me minding my fucking business? Or or what? It's best to mind your business. I, and I got you, Emmanuel. What up with it, Emmanuel? <laughs> we gonna have fun with this one. Let me get my, my girl Toya in on this one, buddy. Yeah. Let's go and get this shit cracking, buddy. You feel what I'm saying? I'm on my way to work this morning. Oh, I got a job, man. D&D &D Customs, man. Hey. What up with it, man? What's going on, man? Say, man. Hey, listen. Wait, wait, let me say, let me say this first. Let me say this first. For all y'all, I'm glad to know that I'm glad for y'all to see Toya is still my friend, even after my little breast cancer rant. And uh, you oh. know, I, <laughs> I, and I didn't bring out the hate him because y'all had a problem with what Sale said, so y'all definitely will have a problem with what hate him said. But you know, at the end of the day, man, I love you, sister, and and, and uh, it's just all about fun and all that. So now, here we are. So now. Me and you have a for real, for real friendship. I mean, we go back history. Mamas, you know, mamas is friends and families is friends. And, and you know, I really do care about you and I'll kill a nigga for you. You feel what I'm saying? But now you're dating somebody on the bike set and you don't know all of their business. And you come to me as a friend and say, so as my friend, you're obligated to tell me about this individual. Am I to tell you? Or am I no. just that you be in that uh -uh. Yeah, okay. I feel like this. You need to mind your business because they might not date you the same way that they might date me. You know okay. what I'm saying? They might have changed in their life somewhere. No, but I'm saying, but I but I'm saying I know something about them right now that you don't know. I know I know this for a fact right now. Unless it's something that got something to do with health. Like they got something, they got they got something that they can't shake loose or something like that. <laughs> then no. You ain't got this. Is my business right here, bro. You ain't got nothing to do with this. Yeah, but you, but you came to me asking me though. As a, you came to but me. But I as wouldn't your... come to. But but the first thing is that's 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 one thing that we got to figure out. We can't. I'm out here in these white folks' neighborhood. I got to be quiet. I'm saying that my girl house. I can't come out outside <laughs> hollering. <laughs> but that's the first thing. With me, we as women, we gotta if we dating somebody. Stop dating them, the people that they dated before, the women that, I mean, the men, the people that know them and all that type of stuff. Keep your business to yourself until you until you build a solid foundation with somebody. You but, ain't got to go asking everybody's opinion. No, 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 but, but listen, but I think what, what I'm saying is, though, I think what I'm telling you, this is, Toyo, I'm not just talking about random, uh, listen to what I'm saying, Let, hear me out what I'm telling you. This. Me and you are truly friends, we've been friends. You're you're in a different place in your life, and I didn't know, I didn't know. Like I said, we you know you grew up, I grew up, and now we back together, or we we somehow we we connect. We let's just say we reconnect. Oh, what up, man? Oh, good to see you. And you say, yeah, 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 I'm good. I'm like, how you doing? I'm fine. I'm you know, uh, I'm like, yeah, well, I'm riding motorcycles now. You're like, oh, for real, my boyfriend riding motorcycles. What? My fiance, my my fiance riding motorcycles. I'm like, oh, for real? Well, I should know him. What's his name? And you tell me his name, and you calling him your fiance. And I know that that can't be possible. Listen, let me say this, okay? As a woman, that happens to me more times than none because I'm a woman in a <laughs> male-dominated situation. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. girls come up to me all the time like, do you know my friend? You know, he rad, whatever, whatever. And this be the biggest hole on this side of Mason Dixon line, okay? <laughs> and I be like, oh, yeah, I know him. Like, you know, I know him. Okay, well, yeah, me and him about to get married or whatever. He might be fucking something. I'm telling you, I be sitting here looking at people like, mm, 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 but that ain't none of my business because you don't. Once you get that information, I ain't gonna have nobody go back and be like, well, Toya said or something. I'm not about to be involved in that shit Period. because she might take that information and still decide to continue. Now you don't. You don't gotta wear. When I go to places, I'm. It's awkward for me. Because I done got in somebody's business that ain't got nothing to do with me. That nothing part. to do with me at all. I tell you, if I if I know the person, yeah, I know them. You know, okay, yeah, all right, yeah, okay, I know them. As long as it ain't somebody I'm messing around with, then, and I feel like, I ain't gonna say that, because bitches might think I'm scandalous, because I was about to be like, as long as it ain't somebody I'm messing around with, and then I might not still say nothing. I might go and be like, hold on, nigga. Somebody came and asked me about you. But anyway, I just feel like 
we ain't, don't don't put nobody in your business and don't get in nobody's business. Ride your bike, live your life, and 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 mind your business. That's what that's what people get. That's what people get it twisted at. And and that's one of the things. And see, and this the, and this and this is why I said what, what, what Roman Moses said, bro. If I come to you and ask you a question, you better answer me because you know I went through that shit, nigga. Sad he wasn't married. Nigga said he wasn't married and he was. So if it's something like that, bro, a true friend will let them know. Will let them know that. See, I, let me tell y'all something. I disagree. And 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 and, and even Lord, a was saying loyalty over bullshit. But this is what I'm saying, y'all. You have to understand the dynamics of men versus women, okay? Ramona, if I know you fucking with a nigga that's married and you happy, my job as your friend is to see you happy. I know you're going to go through some shit later on or, or you know, when you do find out some shit and be mad at me. Like, say you knew this nigga, but it's not my business, man. Because, because they might, they, listen, you never know what that person's situation or how, to, I'm going to say it on this end. You never know. Once I give you that information, okay, yeah, I done gave you the tools to figure out how you can have a good relationship or whatever the case may be. But now, you might not, that might not be enough to break the camel's back. That might not be the straw to break the camel's back. You still might be with that person. But, not, but, but I look at it like this. I, this is like how I look at it, okay? And and, and this is what, and, and I'm glad my sister Ava, because I would love to get her on here too. This is what I'm saying, though. The, the line the, the line is thin and the line is drawn between me minding my business and the loyalty to my friend. Okay. Loyalty to my friend is and this this is how I'm looking at it, y'all. So don't be mad at sale. I'm looking at it like this. If you happy in a relationship, what else fucking matters? Uh, yeah, because you don't need me to make, you don't you don't you don't need me you don't, you don't need me or my information to make you unhappy. You don't as need long me to... as he ain't out here handing out that package, I ain't got nothing to do with it, okay? Hey, listen here, Mike. I don't, I'm listen not about here, to tell you nothing because he might be separated. He might be legally married. They might be separated, okay? That ain't got nothing. They might, he might, it might not be what it is at home. If you out here, if I feel like this, and this is if you go to another country. I'm about to go to another state. I'm about to go to Dallas. I got two more days, okay? I don't have nobody there that I can be like, do you know this person? Do you? You got to do your own investigation. But see, but, but 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 listen, what I'm saying. So when my friend approached me with it, I'm like, listen, oh no, I'm straight. Well, well, do you do you know something? I said, man, all I know is you ride a cool look, you know, decent little ugly looking motorcycle, and that's it. Ah, come on, you know more than that. Listen, don't use me to confirm your feelings or or to confirm a suspicion. You feel what I'm saying? Even as your friend, as your friend, I love you and I want to see you happy. If you unhappy. Then you unhappy, but don't be unhappy because of what sales said or because of what sales or whatever. Because understand this. This is the part that I'm trying to get into this morning. As friends, we have an obligation. And as men, we have men law and women have women law. Now, as a woman, Toya, and you probably can answer this, and you can't answer this, but I'm saying as a woman. <laughs> As a woman, because you know you a man to me, I don't be fucking you say. But anyway, as a woman, as a woman, for a man, I look at it like this: I would be breaking man law to tell you about your dude. You understand what I'm saying? Because that's not my business. Even if I'm trying to fuck, I'm not gonna dirty match man motherfucker to fuck you or to get close to you or to be next to you or none of that. And it's just like it's just like even in me and my even in me and Queen relationship. Like I tell Queen all the time, and I and I promise you this, I'm not looking for shit. If you fucking four five other niggas, and that's what you're doing, hey, handle your business. But if I find out, and when I when I say find out, I ain't talking about no punk ass text message, no email, you know, no niggas telling me shit, or no female telling me shit. I'm talking about when I tap you on the shoulder, hey, little sugar. Yeah, the next thing you're gonna see is the double barrel up, uh, straight up your motherfucking dome. You understand me? This is what I'm gonna say. This and, and you might need to get somebody on here that's the, uh, on the other side because it sounds like me and you on the same side. So I'm gonna say this though. I feel like this when I start dating the dude. I don't. I now. Okay, I ask him if you married or whatever. You know, if I when I meet him and all that type of stuff. But after I ask him, I don't worry about that shit no more because I feel like this. 
if you date me as a full time job, nigga, because I need you coming over taking out trash. I need you uh to like cleaning off snow. I might need to help with a bill or two. I'm putting that out there, y'all. I need my date me as a full time job. I'm kind of needy sometimes, okay? So if he dating other people, that shit gonna fall off. And I got that from. And then also my thing is this. I got this advice from a real wise woman, Medea, okay? If something is wrong, or you feel like something is wrong, and you dating somebody, and you got to worry about, is he, do they got somebody else there? Obviously, they not treating you the way you feel like you're supposed to be treated if you think that it's some, somebody else in a relationship, or whatever the case may be. So get out for that reason alone. You ain't got to do no investigations and stuff like that. But if this, I don't go looking for shit unless I feel... I, I, I just don't. So, but my thing is, when I meet somebody, if, if this, if they dating somebody, is, if, you know, if I don't see the signs that they marry and I choose to continue to date them, then I don't worry about it because I feel like that shit gonna fall off anyway. Because they can't, they ain't gonna be, they ain't gonna be able to juggle me. Only a clown find it hard to juggle. So I don't be worried about it. Like I said, me personally, the only way I can catch, the only way me and Queen will ever have an issue about another nigga is if I catch it. And y'all gonna know about it because I'm gonna be locked up in jail with a big ass smile <laughs> on my face. You know what I'm talking about? What you in there for, man? I you know killed and chopped up four, five times and fed it to the dog. You know what I'm talking about? That's hey, it. Yeah. Hey, you know. <laughs> I'm a, I want you. I'm gonna go off here. I want you to. I want you to invite Ramona or yeah, Ava no, here because I want. Yeah. I'm gonna get Ramona here right now. I'm gonna get Ramona. Right. Ramona All right. Because I want to hear. I'm listening. I'm on the way to. I'm on my way to the doctor to get my last little tune up before I get up out of here. Put my legs up in these stirrups real quick. Right, so, okay, I'm yeah, keep, <laughs> hey, keep that little bald head truth to yourself. You know I, mean? <laughs> hey, man, I love you too, man. Be up. <laughs> hey, Ramona. Can I get you on here, Ramona? Can I get Ramona on here? Or Ava? Which one? Ramona or Ava, man? All I'm saying is this, y'all. You have to know when to hold them and when to fold them. And, 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 I, and I like Ramona's perspective because Ramona is my friend. Uh, Ramon, I want to I want to invite you on. Ramon, I can't invite you. Block the. Uh, no, I don't want to block her. I want to invite her on. If I can't invite her, um, who else? Who else want to get on here about this subject? All I'm saying is this, man, is that you have to be careful. There's a thin line between friendship and 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 minding your business, man. And I think that a lot of people get it confused. Like I understand what you're saying, Mona. You are my sister. So if you fucking with a nigga that I know ain't shit. Uh, I, I got to stay out of that, though, sis. I got to. You feel what I'm saying? I, I kind of, because that's your thing, man. I don't know what your purpose of fucking with this nigga is. The nigga might be a paymaster. You know, you might be you might be the one that, that tricked the nigga. You feel what I'm saying? You feel know what I'm saying? He been tricking all the bros. Now you get him, and you tricked the nigga. So, you know, I, I don't know, man. Carissa, I'd rather know in the beginning, been through that BS too many times at least, fly me a kite. Okay, well, Carissa, can you come on? I can't get Ramon on here. What about Ava? Ava, can you get on here? I think you said you in your pajamas, son, sis. Uh, Tia, my, that's what I'm saying, James. She, yeah. Kevin Ricks. Pull, okay, here we go. Let's, let's get Ava on here, man. Let's get Ava on here, man. Let's get the governor on here, man. Y'all get to meet the governor, man. Real truth, too. I hope y'all ready for this, man. Real truth, man. What up? What up with it, Ava? <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. You know you on some bullshit. It's no, loyalty. Hey, man. Loyalty over bullshit. Hey man, this is a this is a legit question, man. So now understand this, y'all. Ava is a little more, you know, a little older, more mature. She, you know, been there, done it. And let me tell you something. Ava's a boss. She's been a boss in the streets. I ain't talking about just a boss on her job. So she got a whole di she done had a stable before herself. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> so, <laughs> you silly. So, so, so. Come hey, on. tell them about the bank when I go to the bank. That part right there, the bank bounce. When you go to the bank, the bank bounce. <laughs> okay, okay, then. <laughs> but so that's bullshit. Loyalty. You know, I'm about loyalty and respect. Okay, so you give me if your I come to you, if okay. I come to you and I ask you, hey, what's up with dude? And he married or he got a girlfriend, and you don't tell me. Who I'm coming back to when I find out. Me? Exactly. What so, happens to but, our friendship? But, what happens to our friendship? And, 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 it, and it, it, it's, it's a cross put it. I mean, it's a dagger put in there. You feel what I'm saying? Exactly. You're going to respect. Mm -hmm. We're going to be cool, but you ain't going to be, you, you know, we ain't going to have that, that, that intertwined relationship that we got now. So, but Ava, explain to me 
or explain to the people how that works because I'm telling you, it's kind of a it's kind of a slippery slope. Do you do you have to have a certain level of friendship with that person, or is it is it just you know how how does that work? To me, it don't matter. Okay. If I consider you my friend, you my friend. But it's a difference between friends, associates, and people that you just know. Okay. But if you my friend, that's where my loyalty stands with you. You're supposed to keep me up on game. Okay. Your word to me is your bond. Because that's all we got is our word. Okay. So if you don't tell me, then you break that bond between us. So we have nothing else going. I can't trust you no more. Mm, mm. You know, I keep it street. That's just how I roll. I'm in my and that's even with a female. Yeah. If I go to her and she knows something and she don't tell me, we done. Simple as that. Okay, okay. Family well, members as well. If, I cut their ass off too. <laughs> so Toya say, but what if he say he married and that ain't current? Now I'm a hater. No, you're not hating. You you telling me what's going on, and then it's up to me to make that decision if I want to deal with that or not. Mm. So for you, friends, okay, so now, okay, so let's just say, now here it is now, let's just say me and you, been, me and you haven't talked, it's been about four or five years, and now we run into each other. And you done married, and you married, or you were you really into the, you've been to the dude like three years or two years, and y'all living together the whole nine yards, or you think y'all living together. And I run into you like, what's going on, Abel? You tell me, oh, yeah, yeah, so and so, man, I can't wait for you to meet my dude. And you tell me his name, and I say, whoa, that's your dude? You say, yeah. But I know for a fact that he got something else going on. And y'all been together like two years. And I mean, to you, y'all living together the whole nine yards. Is my obligation still loyalty to you at that point, or am I supposed to mind my business? Loyalty to me. There it is there. Okay. That's loyalty to me. There it is there. And then it's up to me as a friend to say thank you and then make my decision if I'm going to stay or bounce. Okay. Simple as that. Yeah. It's loyalty. Loyalty over bullshit any day. Loyalty over bullshit any day. Exactly. Well, I love you. So let me get a man on here and see. Let me get a man on here and see what he say. Because love you too. I love you too. Bye. All right. All right, bye. All right, so man, we got we got a couple of interesting um perspectives on this one. Toya say mind your business. Ava say stay loyal to your friend. I was trying to bring Ramona on here, um, uh, you know, but she uh, for whatever reason. Let me see. What about Isaac? Isaac, you up this morning? Let me get Isaac on here, man, before he get to work. Let me see. Um, bring Isaac on camera. This is my man Isaac, man, my man Ike, real good friend, man, my partner, my pal. All right, get on here, man, real quick, man. Let's, let me get your perspective on it, man. From a man's perspective, you know, heard two women with the opposite opinion of it. So let me get a man on here and see what he's saying. What up, boy? What's going on with you, baby? What's going on with you, baby? Not much, man, chilling. Say, man, am I breaking man law and am I staying loyal to my friend, man? What am I doing, man? Hey, depends on the situation. <laughs> um, <laughs> hey, I'm being honest, bro. Hey, I've made, look, I've been there. Look, I've. Put a brother on game, let him know what was up. He got mad at me. I covered for a brother to let him know. I'm covering for his lie, and I get daggone told it that I was trying to get with his girl. Like, like, dude, I'm covering for your lie. The lie you told me to cover you for, now you mad because she caught you. <laughs> so, bruh. But look, I'll be honest with you, man. Hey, I agree with, with what she said about the loyalty. Um, people that we call our friends, people that's in our inner circle, inner circle, key, that's key, inner circle. Okay. We owe each other loyalty. Now, if you know something is messed up from the get-go and that they're about to get in it, then I owe you my loyalty to actually let you know. Once you make your decision, hey, my only my only job then is just support your decision. Now, when you now when you find out that it was really the way I told you was, hey, that's your fault. I warned you as 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 my loyalty, you know. Hey, I got a couple of homeboys, the homegirls that we real with each other, and we tell each other straight up. Um, and that's what keep our friendship tight is that you is uh, that we don't cut corners with each other. Okay, so if 
a homeboy that uh, a homegirl that you know for a while, she dating one of your partners, and it's your partner now that you fuck with. You know, spend a night at your house, come over to the house, and your homegirl you grew up with or whatever. You know, you you you, you know you you know your you you more loyal to your partner than you are as a female. But the female come to you and ask you, but you, like you say, inner circle. So your partner is in your inner circle. So what do you tell a female? It ain't your business. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, all right, all right. Okay, now since both are on my inner circle, both are on my inner circle, or just, no, just one partner, or the other? Just the partner. Now listen to this though. The, the the girl that's coming to you is your wife, is your wife's friend or your girlfriend? You your your girlfriend's girlfriend. You know this is her partner that you know you know and whatever. She come to you like I. Man, what's going on with your boy Sale? Man, I'm really digging this. We going on six months now. And I really do like this cat. You feel what I'm saying? And but now Sale is in the inner circle now. I ain't gonna do it. <laughs> I ain't gonna do it. I'm not in there. No. Sorry, can't help you. Hey, that is your business. I keep myself out of it. You gonna keep yourself out of it? I keep myself out of it. Now, my partner? Hey, dog, check it out, man. Old girl, come and check it up on you, man. Yeah. See, hey, but that's my girlfriend. Nah, sorry, dog. Hey, sorry. <laughs> man code laws. So, your wife, so, so, okay, so now let me give you this. So, now you marry, you marry, and your wife come to you and say, hey, hey, man, what's going on with Sale, man? My girl really falling for him. You know, she talking about getting him a key to his apartment and all that. Is he a good dude? What do you tell your wife now? About sale, which is your partner now. I'm your motherfucking partner. Hey, you ready? Yeah, I'm <laughs> you ready? For, you ready for this answer? <laughs> Baby, I love you so much. Baby, I love you so much. But that's their business. You and I need to keep out of it. That's what it is. That's what it is. Oh, so that's but look, so, I but so you but look, like, check so this out. Like got some other shit going on. Hey, no, I'm telling you, that's none of your business. That's none of mine either. Hey, that's your friend. That's my homeboy. They like each other. They kicking it. They've been kicking it for a while. Hey, to keep ourselves mutual friends in this venture, then we stay. Um, uh, what's that word? Then we stay um, uh, partial to everything that's going on. I'm fair to him. I'm fair to her. You fair to him. You fair to her. Hey, <laughs> leave their business alone. None of my business. <laughs> Now, however, Sam, now, however, now, what if it's that it's two people that's in your inner circle? Okay. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah. How do you do? I got that? one better for you. Okay. Hey, if you got two people that's in your inner circle, now, everybody know your inner circle are the people that know more about you than any, than, than any other associate. These are the people that if you really need money or you really need something, these yeah, are the people the, that you the, go the to. The real inner right? circle. The inner circle circle. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Now, to be fair and impartial in all things, and you let both know what the deal is straight up. Hey, oh girl is like this, oh boy is like this. You let both of them know. You put both of them on game, and then and then you tell both of them, yo, I told her about you, and I told and I told you about him. Point blank and simple. Now you go from there. Hey, that's everybody else's business. What whatever happens from that point, that's their business. I still keep myself out of it. My name Bennett ain't in it. Hey, hey, Bay Th Bay Thorp say, I lost a friend thirty years with that BS. Don't do it. Don't do what, Bay? Don't don't tell them. Don't that ain't none of your business. Just keep it to yourself. Hey, so, hey, Bay. Hey, this, this, hey. This, thing, though. this 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 my thing. Okay, my thing is this, and this is what I tell everybody. You ain't got to tell me about my relationship. If I'm happy, like I said, and I'm and I'm just using it to say this. If if my wife Queen is fucking four five other cats. And I'm and, and, and she doing her thing and I'm happy. And I'm telling y'all right now, if you know, keep it to your motherfucking self because Cell ain't tripping. Because when I find out, you're gonna know that Cell tripping. And it's just that simple. Now exactly. if I see your wife out cheating, I'ma mind my business. It ain't my business. If, if, exactly. If I catch your wife out cheating or if I catch you out cheating. And if and if, if I if my wife know you cheating. Because that's what some of you niggas can't do. Some of you niggas can't control your 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 wife or your girlfriend. You know, some of them, you know. But I'm telling you, I control mine. When I tell, hey, shut up and mind your business, that's exactly what she's going to do is shut up and mind her business. But exactly. you know, I just feel like me personally, it ain't my business, man. It, it ain't my business. If you come to me as a friend and you ask me, 
saying what's going on with Ike? What's going on with Ike? Man, I don't. I, I just don't feel like it's my business to tell you about Ike's business. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, you know, exactly. That's just that's just how I feel. Now, if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. And like Ava say, if she come to me and asks me, I'm violating our friendship law. Then I mean, it's 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 just kind of a it's kind of a crazy situation, man. That shit is just kind of crazy, man. For me, it is. But you know, but, but hey, anyway, hey, yeah, yeah. I, I, check this out, babe. I appreciate you. Y'all heard from my y'all heard from two women, different this different different sides. You heard from my man. He gave you a scenario. Let me try to get somebody else on the because this shit is interesting to me because. I'm telling you, everybody, I think it, I think it has to do with what region you from. Know, kind of some West Coast, you know, loyalty, down, up north, down south is different. But I love you, brother. You no, say up. Hey, hey, Sal, you know, to be very honest, what it what it really is, what it truly is, is that you got some dudes, you got some women, they just got loyalty issues. Yeah. If you got loyalty issues, then why are you trying to date? <laughs> Niggas, keep, keep your dick at home. Keep your pussy at home. <laughs> Once you do that, yeah. nigga, wait, everything good. Yeah. Now, if you have a mutual agreement, that's between, hey, I got a homeboy that him and his wife, they got a mutual agreement. If he want to get down, he literally calls her, send a, send, 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 send a picture, be like, yo, this is it. Do I have your approval? Yes or no? If she say no, he say, hey, sorry. Hey, everything's over with. That but they get down like that. So, but remember, keep it at home and you ain't got nothing to do and you won't have these kind of issues. Only ones that got issues is when they're trying to play the field. Now, we're going to go on a whole nother subject and I don't want, and I don't want to go there right now. <laughs> they ain't ready for it, dog. They ain't ready for it. Look here, man. I love you, man. We're going to get this thing. Right? Let, me get, let me get a, hey, Keisha, let me see if I can get Keisha Hamilton on the phone. All right, All right bro. Man. Peace. Love you, bro. All right. Hey man, Keisha, where you at? I just saw Keisha on here. I need to get Rare Breeze Skunk on here too. Skunk, what you doing, man? Uh, where? Uh, oh, I can get Nasty on here too. Another dude. Let me get Nasty. Nasty, where you at, man? Let me get Nasty on camera real quick. Then I'm gonna get to you later, Keisha. And after Nasty. Oh, Kevin can't come on. Okay, I'm sorry. Let me see. Where was Keisha at? Where was Keisha at? Keisha Brown. Keisha, Keisha, Keisha. Where you at, Keisha? Oh, you know what? I can bring my man Riley Fuller on. Hey, hey. Come on, come on on here, big dog. Damn, you can't come on camera neither. What the fuck going on? Dirty D, I already know what you're going to say, but I'm going to bring you on anyway, too. Ramona can't come on. I thought I saw Keisha. Keisha, where you at? All right, so listen. Oh, you know what? Th this is the thing, man. The line between being your friend's friend and minding your business, I think, is uh, it it's, it's, a, it's just a real thin line. I think it's a real thin line. Keisha, come on here, man. I got you now. I just think it's a real, real thin line, man. And it's kind of crazy because I'm telling you, you can become the hated person. Trust me. Keisha, what up? Good morning. Good morning, Big Sal. Hey, good morning to you, sis. So the, 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 I hope you've been hearing the topic. The topic is... Do I stay loyal to my friend or do I answer the question, man? You stay loyal to the friend and don't answer no question. Oh, okay. So you, Keisha, you already know me and my, Keisha's my baby. Y'all know that. That's my girl. You know what I'm talking about? If you came to me and asked me about a nigga that you dating, I'm supposed to mind my business. You're supposed to mind your business. I ain't got no business asking you about the next nigga. That's for me to just investigate on my own. Okay. I, I I I feel like nobody should tell nobody's business. Well, there it is. Yeah. That's troublemaking. Uh, and I shouldn't be going. I shouldn't go around asking. I mean, but you That's, ain't getting fell in love with this nigga, man, and you just kind of want to know you and your feelings. Well, then hell, if I fell in love with a dog ass nigga, then shit, I'll find out he's a dog ass nigga. That's gonna be his trouble. Lavin say we can become the hated person. Relationship and friendship are different. You mess around in someone's relationship and you're going to in, into uncharted territory. I agree. I rode with him, knew what he was, but that was, this is my man, Bay Thorpe, but that was my dog. But my best friend fell for him and had heard me talk about him. I told her not to do it. They went behind my back, dated anyway. He dogged her. She dogged her. 
and she stopped talking to me. Damn it, man. See, that's my thing, Keisha. As a man, we as a man, we've been talking. Mind your business, and you know. So now I'm. So if this is my sister, let's say for that's why I don't like my sister. You know my my family, and I tell any of my family that come on the set, my my direct family, sister, cousins, aunties, or whatever. Listen here, man. Only thing I'm gonna tell you on this set, when they ask me about coming to the motorcycle parties, come have a good time and understand this: everybody ain't who they say they is. That's the best advice I can give. That's the best Absolutely. advice. And that's what I give all my family, uh, immediate family or whatever that come on the set. And understand this, you grown, because you gotta you're supposed to be 21 and over, 21 and older to be at to be in a motorcycle function and in a motorcycle party. So whatever you decide to do with whoever individual is that. Now, it's some niggas on the set that I wouldn't want nowhere near my family. But but again, that's not my choice. All I'm gonna tell you is, don't bring that nigga to the Thanksgiving dinner. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> that nigga can't come eat it. That nigga can't come get no turkey. Why he can't? It's my, it's my dude. I don't give a fuck. That nigga not allowed in my house. You know I'm talking about to come eat nothing because I know he's a slimy motherfucker. But like I said, even with my own family, even if it was my daughter, oh my goodness, and and, and it's hard for me. as a dad. I have to say this, even if it was my daughter. If it was my daughter and she came on the set and fell for a dog ass nigga, what is my loyalty as a as a father and as and as whatever? So that that's kind of crazy, man. But I, uh, I, I, mean, I still think you only you only can give so much advice. Long as it ain't no hands on situation, mind your business when it come to that. Mm. Mind your business. That's all. That's all I can say. Mind. I'm in the mind my I'm in my mind in the mind my business uh 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 you know business. You know, I can't give you no information about nobody. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> I'm in the, I don't know motherfucking business. You started you, shit early in the morning. I'm sitting here on the job trying to pay attention. Hey man, I, I, it ain't it ain't that I'm starting shit, man. I'm just this is some real shit that's going on because I'm telling you, I've been put in the crossfire of knowing this nigga. And knowing this female, or knowing this female, I mean, you know, knowing knowing this nigga, and, and knowing other, other, and and for me, I just mind my business because, as you can tell, anytime I try to help somebody, I end up losing a friend, and all yeah. I, <laughs> and all I did was try to help you. You know what I'm talking about? So I don't need fuck to help. If 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 you drowning, and I'm on my raft, and I see you drowning, I'm to be honest, I'm gonna keep on rowing, man, because I'm trying to understand it. Every time I try to help a nigga from drowning, they turn my they turn you my boat over. There? Hey, they turn my boat over. You feel what I'm saying? I'm in my little rat. They, they, hey, because they never wanted to get in the boat no way. They just didn't want me to. They just wanted me to drown with them. So I just keep going. You feel yep. what I'm saying? Yep. I put, hey, I put my Dre beats on and I just keep rowing, man. I, 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 I was calling you self, man. I ain't even hear you play. My bad. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, man. So, hey, but since I love you, I'm going to let you go and get back to work. I'm going right, to hey, I'm gonna right, bring my man Darwin. Hey, Darwin. I'm going to bring right. my man Darwin on. He, he, now, this this dude right here kind of special. I know he's going to say some way out pimp shit. So, let me bring Tell him on. I'm ready. I'm ready. Good right. morning. <laughs> Darwin, where you at, babe? Let me bring on my man Darwin, man. So, listen, the topic is loyalty, friendship, mind your business. What do you do? Do you stay loyal to your friend asking you about their business and you tell them or you mind your business about their business and you tell them? Hey, say, man, I don't need you on here gangbanging this morning. Say man. what it is, man. <laughs> so you heard the topic. You heard the discussion. Yo, yo, I come to you about a female that you know about. Do you tell me the 411 or you tell me, hey, Cell, I, I, I really don't know. Hey, Cell, I'm going to just tell you, come on, Cell, let's have a drink. Let's go get some food. I know how to ease your mind, man. Let's go eat something. Let's get your mind off some shit, Cell. No, fat nigga, I, I got fat you. Nigga, you know, I'm on my little diet. Yeah, I'm fat nigga don't turn down food, man. That's what you said. <laughs> so. <laughs> I ain't going to lie, though. 
If it's my daughter, say, I'm sending my enforcers to see you, my okay, nigga. Okay, so, so wouldn't it be better off to tell your daughter? That, that's, that's, that's what it is, my can't fuck with this nigga? They just deal with, they deal with her blood at all. It ain't, it's not, oh, I'm going to mind my business. You know nigga, we coming to see. On game, I already knew what he was going to do. I already knew what he was going to do. So if, if your daughter fall, fall for a nigga that's on the set that you know ain't no good, you just going to step to the nigga right off the rip. Hey, off the muscle, my nigga. Leave mine so alone, then, dog. Okay, if but, you don't hey, leave that hey, one hey, alone, we gonna have a problem. Well, I can't say it's with your daughter, cause she followed behind her dad, and she, you know, she should be able to do that. I, I don't know, man. I just tell mine, listen, man. Ain't nobody on the set who you think they. I ain't gonna say nobody. Most of the people on the set are not who they think they are, and just be careful. You know what I'm saying? Do what you do. You know, and 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 my daughter. I mean, I I, I think I've given her enough tools to know who is and who ain't. And, and there's some slick niggas out here. Because I'm one of the slickest when, it, you know what I'm saying, back in my day. But there's some slick niggas out here. You just got to be careful. I, I say this. If she find a nigga on the set, hey, nigga, we got to do some investigations. Bring him to the club. But, but he should already so he know that anyway. Because, I mean, you know, well, most niggas don't give so a fuck. So he can understand he that this shit real. He, once he say, my daddy is my daddy is so and so and so and so. He should already, if he takes exactly. the risk on that, no, he should already don't. know what the risk come with. But as a true player, though, as a true player, I'm going to say, hey, man, I ain't fucking your daddy. I'm fucking you. So tell him to mind his business. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. Hey man, as long as mine take care of home, boy, I'm 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 real great. I'm good. Harris say, how is it how is it going? How is the person yeah. going to be loyal when they can't be loyal to themselves? And I and I hear you, lady, but like I said, I'm we're talking about the thin line between loyalty, friendship, and mind your business. I think that as a man, you have to maneuver around all of those different situations, and you have to be careful because at the end of the day. When, when it's told that, man, a nigga sell, told my girl, man, all about I was married and this and this and that. You feel what I'm saying? But, you know, the, the girl is is, is sales cousin or, or, or auntie. Ain't nobody going to give a fuck about that. Sale just going to be a slimy, uh, messy motherfucker. Yeah, you you gotta know when you put the when you gotta know when you when to put your nose in in other folk business. Cause I'm telling you, like I said, if it's my, if it's my kid, yeah. man, I can't I can't yeah. just motherfucking say, oh no, I'm okay, not so, going, I'm gonna mind so, my business. So, no, so, nigga, you gotta see me. If it's a homeboy, hey, homie, mind my business. Hey, look, my auntie older than I, so if so she don't you, know off the muscle so what she's dealing with, so then that's her thing. <laughs> that part. <laughs> okay, okay. My mama, my mama keep that thirty thirty, so I ain't got to worry about my mama. And she, and she yeah. ride a two thousand seventeen Harley, uh, CVO yeah, yeah, Rogue yeah, Light. Yeah, yeah. You okay. know what I'm talking about? Well, Jenny, ain't worry uh, about that. We should keep Jenny that thirty thirty. Es Escalante say, I think there is a thin line between what to say and who to say it and who to say it to. I'm with you, Jenny, and and, and that's what and that's what we're talking about. Now, what you got, Dawn? Say it. You one one more thing, Jenny. You see this right here? That motherfucker say check it and respect it. Okay, so if you don't I check it and respect it before you, you fuck so, with mine, so, homie, I'm, I'm gonna make you respect Deandra, that shit. My daughter Deja, uh, 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 and, and my and my other baby girl. Check this out, man. You can't fuck with nine nigga on the motorcycle set because they ain't none of them niggas shit, including me. How about that? <laughs> that part. And if you got any problems, call your uncle Silent Assassin set, and we going to come down there and see some shit. Man, I want that man, part. But I'm just saying, it's just an interesting topic to me, man. I kind of had a, a, a couple of weeks ago, man, I kind of had this and I've been thinking about, you know, the whole thing. But it is what it is, man. So, I appreciate you, brother. Truly, I do. Later. So we got that going on. So, 
Who else we got? Uh, let's see who else we got. Uh, what happened? What happened? What happened? Guest receipts invite to watch. Invite to watch. All right, so y'all, that's what it is, man. You, you've heard several different opinions on it. Um, heard several different opinions on it, and I just. All right, Carissa, let me bring you on, Carissa. Let me bring you on, Carissa. I like Carissa. Lavish, opinions cause problems. Mind your business and don't get involved. Oh, Carissa denied. Let me see. Lavish. Come on here, Lavish. Let me get Lavish on here, man. My celebrity partner. My celebrity partner, Lavish. Lab, what up, man? <laughs> what up, man? You called me up, man. What's happening? <laughs> Say, man, you know what we're talking about. So listen here, man. Sal is your partner. You feel what I'm saying? But I'm dating somebody, a female that you real close to, man. You know Sal got queen, and he married. But the female called you and say, Lavish, I'm falling in love with this nigga. You know, the whole nine yards. Is he a good nigga? What does Lavish do, man? <laughs> <laughs> man do, hey, listen. First of all, when they come to me and they already they already come to me asking me these questions, listen, I want to tell them off rip. I ain't trying to get involved in nothing that y'all got going on. I don't even want my name brought up in it. That's that's what's gonna come. When they get to ask me, I don't want my name brought up in it, man. I don't know what you're talking about. You gotta ask yourself. But on the flip side, as far as being a loyal friend, just like Ava was saying. A certain amount of loyalty do apply, and I will only probably see that in the beginning of a uh, when you first meet somebody, man. And what I mean by that is, it's, it's typical. It ain't no different than a man or a woman just meeting somebody off top, and they and they say, "Hey, what what what's up with sale? What's up with help?" Naturally, male or female, you probably go into a discussion about it. Yeah, I know Sal. Yeah, man, he a, he a cool, he a cool guy, man. You know, he a I. He married or what he doing? I mean, I don't know. I think he married, but I mean, I don't know. Why don't you ask him? I'm gonna spin it off to the point where I'm not telling you nothing. Go back, I'm gonna run circles around you. Hey, go holler, ask him. You know, I really can't really tell you too much about it. Okay, okay. So you go, you gonna, you gonna stick to the man code? Cause to me, that's I'm the man. I'm gonna stick to it, man. You know. It's one of the things where I'm caught in the middle because one way or the other, somebody going to be mad at you. Somebody going to be mad at you, man. Yeah. I'm telling yeah. somebody business or I ain't put them up on game. But, I mean, but you grow, man. You got to figure that out yourself. If you meet this guy and y'all kicking it and whatever he's telling you and, and that's what he's telling you, then, hey, go go for it. You dig it and trying to find extra stuff, you, you, you about to cause problems yourself. You do, you dig it if you if you dig it deep and you calling me asking me about somebody else, man. Then, then you probably don't even really need to be be kicking it with them. Yeah. I mean, but then here we go again. If I just met this chick and I call you up and I asked you, "Sell, what's up with this girl named Tasha?" And you 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 know it ain't at that point, I don't believe that it's any business to tell me, said you putting me up on game with her. Yeah, she a chick. She got like five kids, you know what I'm saying? Her and her baby daddy go back and forth, blah, blah, blah. But, you know, that's pretty much it. I, I don't think that's really, you know, putting too much out there because now you're giving me that choice of do I even want to be bothered with this woman. But after I get to kick it with a chick, you come to put my business out there. Or involved in none of that stuff. I don't want to be involved in none of that stuff. If y'all going through some stuff, what's up with him? I think he cheating on me. Blah blah blah. No, I, I, oh, shit, I ain't got nothing to do with that. That ain't really. That ain't my business. If I see you and your girl out, is she doing her thing? I mean, if I see you out and you with another chick, it ain't my business. Come back, running, telling your wife. 
What don't want to look like a rat? You know yeah, what I'm yeah. He lavish, you know, lavish told me because it's gonna come out. Lavish told me that he seen you downtown with a chick. You know what I'm saying? What you wanna do? Come back to lavish, lavish. Why you out here speaking on me? Why is you bringing problems into my relationship? You know what I'm saying? So now nah, I'm going back to old girl. Like man, why you, why you, why you tell your dude that I told you that? Did you not think she was gonna come back and tell me? They don't think about that. They think it's between, you know, him and her or whoever the friend is. The friend is going to be exposed. And then it's going to cause problems. It normally do. You come back and tell me that your girl told me that I see you downtown with, you know, another chick. Yeah, she going to be mad, but the guy going to be right back with the girl. So what happened? You done caused problems in the relationship. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm, I mean, I got you. And, I, and that's my whole thing over this this. Like so if, you ain't involved, if you ain't nope. if you ain't if you don't even get in the business, you can't even be put in the middle. Or uh, no back and forth, he says, she says stuff. Well that 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 was my thing earlier when I said, don't use me to be unhappy. You feel what I'm saying? Or don't use me to confirm if you happy or not. Because that ain't my decision to make. If you unhappy, then you you unhappy. It just see what if you if you asking and, and what they the songs are asking all them questions. If you asking all them questions, yeah, then that, I mean, then you might got other issues besides what I know or don't know no way. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. just, I, I ain't about to get, I ain't about to get in the middle of nobody's business, man. <laughs> I don't even want, don't rap, don't rap, because once you get in that little loophole, trust me, man, once Sale, the, hey, Sale told me about this, man, you know, your name about to float all around town. Then when the homies get to hear it, damn, Sale, I heard that you, uh, <laughs> You was uh, you know, pretty much telling that part right there. See, and see that's telling. what I said. So that's the difference between a man code and the woman code because women feel like they they home girl. That's my home girl. Fuck that. She got to know, and they <laughs> get and they get points for that. But as yeah, men, as men they, we man. we lose points for that. You can't do that as a guy. I mean, you can't do that, man. I I done seen a whole bunch of stuff, man, out here, right on the bike set. It ain't my business to get involved with what you got going on. What we gonna do, man? We gonna be confrontational with each other because now you telling my girl stuff about me. You in my business now. Nah. Ain't no dude trying to hear all that. Ain't no dude about to be all soft and easy about it. Shit, some of these dudes want to fuck you up just for telling your business. Just for telling their business to another person. You don't know what you got, what they got going on in between and behind the scenes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You don't know. I, I, I just say I ain't about to get in nobody's business, man. Yeah. You know, I might keep I'm gonna keep it to myself. I might speak about it with my girl or my homeboy, and we might laugh about it. But as far as going out, you know, spreading this and putting it out there, it, it ain't my place. It ain't my place. That's hey, that's on them. I ain't got nothing to do with it. When it come out, whenever it come out, did it just come out? Oh yeah, I already know about it, but you know what my <laughs> business is getting involved with. Yeah, I, I, I already knew the whole girl. Had, you know what I'm saying? It was fucking four five nigga, but hey, nigga, you is that what you like? It is what right. Oh, I want to laugh about it. Oh, I want to laugh about it. But as far as man, that's too much. That's too much stuff, man. That's too much. You 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 add you add fuel to a fire, man. And then at the, then then you got two people about to fall out. You got two people. Don't come. Don't tell me. Don't tell me about my girl, man. Yeah, and that's how I feel. Don't, don't let, tell me about my girl, me about my because I might. Let, let me, like I said, like I, who I, you like, are. I tell, like I tell Queen all the time, if I don't tap you on the shoulders, then I ain't seen you do shit. I look at it like this, man. You, 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 my friend, you, my, you, you cool, and that's that's cool. But if you coming back telling me about my mate, especially if it's more than one time, I want to feel like you know what's the underlying reason behind it. Are you yeah. coming back because you're just a thorough friend, or if it's if it's another motive? I mean, I think like that. I mean, but you both to think like that. That's 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 what you call a real nigga, uh, a real nigga, uh, spider senses or whatever you want to call them. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's always it's, it's always a hidden agenda. Because understand this, again, me personally, like I said, lavish. Whatever I know, I know. And even when you come to me and ask me, I'm just gonna. Like, dude, I don't even really know that. I ain't never seen no shit like that. I don't know. I, man, I don't even think I. I don't yeah, really I don't that. know, man. And I'm, and I'm gonna leave it at that. Hey, well, yeah, because let me, let me. Yeah. 
Oh, let me, hey, let me get some. Yeah. Ah. Uh, All right. I'm. I appreciate you. Let me. Let me try to get somebody else on here. Sunshine. Let me get on Sunshine. I know. And Sunshine, don't be on here preaching this morning. I don't need you preaching. We, you know, what I'm talking about my girl Sunshine Rogers. You know, what I'm saying, what's going on with your son Cheesy? Yolanda Golden, you say right? What? What's right? Mind my business. Be your friend. You feel what I'm saying? Which one? Or the difference in between the men and the women? There you go, Miss Lady. What's going on? Hey, I love you. We ain't preaching this morning. We, 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 we on. <laughs> what you got going on, Sunshine? Yeah, I love you too. Good morning. Good morning. Chilling. <laughs> hey, so so you know the subject. You know the topic. Mind your business or be your friend's friend. Which one you do? Well, I'm gonna tell y'all. And I'm gonna say this. About about ten years, about five years ago, a friend of mine, we were at a bike rally. And she was we was all supposed to ride together. She get up at five o'clock in the morning, said, Sunshine, I ain't going. Me and my dude, we gonna go to Galveston run a beach house. I said, Girl, you gonna miss the rally? She was like, Yeah, I ain't going, because he said we going to the beach house. Okay, yeah, we we get to Austin. And the dude done drug two bikes down there, but his girl done stayed home. So we get to Austin. He done drug his other bike down there so his other chick can ride the bike. Well, I see the other chick on the bike. I said, oh, hell no, nah, I'm telling. So y'all know what Sunshine did five years ago? I told it. Lost a 20-year friendship from that day on. You give me the end of life. Tell nothing. So now nah, I ain't telling nothing. So you gonna, so from this point forward, you minding your business? Minding my business. See, I, I done seen so much stuff out here, but one thing, and, and, and this is worldwide, because I know you worldwide, can't nobody ever come back and say, well, Sunshine said. No, Sunshine yeah. ain't said nothing. No, no. Now I'm minding no. my business. Yeah. You gonna mind your, so, so Big Cell come to you and say, listen, man, I'm really in love with your with your home girl, man. It's my girl. I'm really in love with her the whole nine yards. What's the dibs on it? You just gonna you gonna mind your business. Mind my business. Hey, Santa, you know, don't come asking me <laughs> nothing about nobody. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and from and from hey. that day on, you gonna be like, damn, I, I ain't asking such nothing. No sir. Yeah. Yeah, no sir. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Kim, Sell, boy, it's, it's so easy. It's, 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 so easy to get, it's so easy to get caught up in stuff out here. I'm telling you, say one word. Just what Lavish just said. Was what, what, what Sunshine said or, or Big Sale said. No, no, I didn't say that. Hey, man, I you just told it? you earlier, I done lost a whole lot of friends for telling the truth. I done lost a whole lot of friends for just telling us, you know, trying to keep it 100 with a motherfucker. <laughs> I didn't told them to, you know, 100, and they didn't end up backfired on me. I ain't shit, this and this and that. So like I said, me personally, even, I, like I said, I mean, people disagree with me with my daughter. If my daughter come on the set, what the fuck? Oh, I thought I just got hit. Oh, no, no, I didn't, didn't get this. And to, if, if my daughter come on the set, I, like I said, I'm going to give my daughter a warning. Check this out. You know, have a good time. Do what you do. If, you know, if you fuck with a nigga, because I tell my daughter this right off the rip. Fuck who you want to fuck, don't let a nigga fuck you. And that's just how I feel. You know, that, as a dad, that's how I feel. If you if you stay in control of what you're doing with your pussy, then it, it, it is what it is. But at the same time, I'm just, just don't, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm with you. I just got to mind my business. I, I really do. I'm dead serious. And I ain't, I don't know shit. Yeah. I ain't seen shit. I ain't I heard shit. I, 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 I have people. Uh, I mean, I have guys coming to me and ask me about some of my girlfriends. I'm not going to even let that to my girlfriends because you know what? I don't want to get that. Now, still, in this day and time, you got to mind your business. Mind your business. Mind your business. Well, there it is there, man. That's from the girl Miss Sunshine. Ken folks. Ava say, my circle asks me, my my circle asks me, I'm telling you loyalty. So Ava say, if she asks me, I gotta tell her the truth. I gotta tell her, I gotta fuck, fuck the, 
other shit. Ava said, I got to tell her, man. So that's how Ava is. And now, Ava, if you ask me, I'm going to tell you. But like I say, Sunshine, and ain't nobody got to worry. Ain't nobody got to worry about you asking me about Queen because I really don't give a fuck. I'm telling y'all some real shit. I, I really don't. You feel what I'm saying? That's just me. I, I really, really the fuck don't. And it ain't me being no insensitive ass nigga. I think I'm no major pimp or nothing like that. I'm I'm happy. I'm just good with mine. So you ain't got to ask me shit. Period. Point blank. You ain't got to ask me. Well, now, no there. If somebody roll up. Then somebody roll up on me and say, well, Sunshine, is Sam married? I'm like, yeah, he married, okay? I didn't answer that question. I'm through with that. You see what I'm saying? Okay. But as far as me just calling up calling up somebody now because I see something, no, I ain't saying nothing. I ain't saying a word. No, but, but I'm, you can't. But I'm even talking you can't, about that. Let's say, we, let's, say one, let's, let's say one of your homegirls. Let's say one of your homegirls is digging, one of your homegirls is digging sale. Can I have a date with you, Sunshine? You hear my cow? <laughs> Terry, what up, Terry? What up, dog? Hey, man. I got. Hey. So, listen to what I'm saying, though. One of your homegirls is really digging me. They digging me and they come to you, Sunshine, man. I mean, I know this is about sale or whatever, but should I fuck with sale? What's your response? Hell no. Leak. <laughs> Now leave that Negro alone, cause I'm tell and this is for, truthfully, I say Sal is married, and I'm out of that. Okay. Yeah, you out of that. Sal, I'm, I'm gonna tell you something. Yeah, yeah, cause Sal, I'm gonna tell you something. It's, it, this bitch can become so broke. You get caught up in mess. See, one thing I don't want is I don't want nobody to say, "Well, well, Sunshine knew, and she didn't tell me." On the marriage side. Yeah, I told you. Yeah. Now leave that down. See, okay, okay, with that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I got you. Yeah, 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 I got you. Okay. Well, I got Latoya back on here. Now it's now it's on them. Sunshine, what if you friends with both parties? That part, Terry Washington. Uh, I saw somebody I wanted to bring on here, man. Uh, I don't know. If, is my signal great, everybody? I think I'm losing y'all. I'm going in and out. Uh, I done finally got to my location. I done got to work. George says, mind your business. Yolanda Golda says, what Lavish said. Adam Garcia Flacco, that's my man. What up, Flock? Okay, now I'm going to ask this. I'm gonna, let me see if I can get Flacco on here. Let me see some Live viewers. Uh, where's Flacco at? Flacco, where you at, Flacco? Flacco, can you come on here, Flacco? Because I'm going to ask you in your opinion. Because I know you you got a different view. Oh, can't. Good morning. I need my pants. Okay. I don't think Flacco can come on. I think it said no. I don't think. Can't bring Flacco. Okay. Okay. Now, like I said, this was an interesting topic, man. I appreciate everybody for being on here. Let me ask. Hey, Scrib, can you come on here, Scrib? Can't bring Scrib on either. Sunshine was on here. Lavis was on here. Jenny was on here. Uh, yeah. So let me tell y'all something, man. And I'm going to say this. If you fucking one of mine or any of mine or mine or whatever, and I don't got no, don't be going back. Oh, Queen Sale said he got a bunch. Of, I'm just saying. You ain't got one up on me. You really don't. Because ain't shit changing my household. Because cause the, way, the way it's going to work for me is when the shit starts changing in my household, that's when I know somebody fucking with mine. So, as long as as long as mines is doing what they're supposed to do and continue doing what they're doing and you getting some, don't think you got one up on sale because you don't. You feel what I'm saying? Because why you 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 better be careful because why you think you fucking one of mine and get got one up on me, I might just have one up on you. You know, just just for you to know. But again, man, loyalty, mind your business or tell your friend, man. It's a thin line between all three. It's a real thin line between all three. Um, 
it, it just is what it is, man, and we're going to have a good time with this shit. But it was some interesting topics. You got women with different opinions. Um, you got a one, um, Ms. Sunshine gave her, uh, gave her account. Matter of fact, let me see. Hey, Terry, what you doing? Can you come on here, Terry? Let me see if I can bring Terry on. I don't know if my signal's pretty good. I think my signal's going in and out, but we're going to figure it out. Terry, can you come on here? Yeah. But for me and mine, man, I'm telling you, don't call and ask sell nothing because I ain't going to tell you nothing. I don't care, you know, friendship, no friendship, loyalty, the whole nine yards. All I'm saying is this, man. We see shit every day. We interpret shit every day. Um, and and it, there is a thin line between all of it because, like I said, the loyalty thing is am I loyal to my friend or do I mind my business? You feel what I'm saying? So that's what it is, man. Okay, I got. Let's get the queen on here. Let me see if I can get the queen on here. The queen, the queen, queen, queen. The queen, the queen, queen, queen. The queen, the queen, queen, queen. What up, little sugar? You at work, huh? Yes, I'm at work. Good morning, everybody. Making my motherfucking money, man. Making my motherfucking money. Man. Motherfucker, you out there making my money. As I told you about that, my shit. Motherfucker, you ain't no pimp right here. And you yeah, ain't no motherfucking man. G. Yeah, so when it. you realize that shit, it, you'll know well, better. Listen, 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 man. Yeah, once you figure this shit out, like, once you figure this shit out, who wants shit, your life would be a whole lot better for you. Thank you to start looking up. But guess you. what? <laughs> guess what? It ain't Marcel Tillman the third. It damn sure ain't you. Yeah, okay. Well, look here, man. Okay. The, qu the question is, mind your business, stay loyal to your friend, or, or you know, whatever you want to do. So, if, if one of your homegirls, or let's say, I'm going to say, well, you I don't know. Look, one of your homegirls that you fuck with meets a nigga on the set, and they date the nigga on the set, but you know the nigga on the set ain't shit. What do you do? It ain't my business, but I'm saying, it's, that's a hard one right there, you know what I'm saying? But, hey, so he says, on, we have, me and you have enough shit of our own, so we ain't got time to be in nobody else's shit. Yeah. Okay, that so. Part. So you don't tell your homegirl, but then your homegirl, your homegirl come and ask you, Queen, what's up with so-and-so? I'm really starting to dig this nigga. I'm finna get this nigga a key to my house. What do you do? Yeah, you better keep your shit. That's all <laughs> it ain't my place, but the only thing you can do is, hey, it's enough shit going on. I had, what up, hell? What's up, sir? Say, what man. up? I need my damn car, man. Hey, man, look at uh, look at. We ain't gonna talk about that. Listen, I'm, I'm back to you. What I'm telling you. <laughs> Please ask her what you gonna do with these damn doors. I go ahead and get this car done. She said she told you fuck the door. That's what she said she told you. No, Queen. That's a... Is that what you said? Yeah, remember I told you. No, no you did not, Queen. No, <laughs> anyway. You, you tell <laughs> Hey, but listen. So let me let me tell you. Hey, everybody. Let me tell you. Let me tell you how this shit. Like I done already told you. I don't give a fuck what you see, what you think you saw, what you heard. You better mind your motherfucking business or face this choke out. Yeah, you understand? Who are you talking about? You. Nigga, okay. Don't let, you don't don't let, let me alive. I can't be making terrorist threats in my uniform. Yeah, don't let this motherfucking uh uh yeah, don't let the uniform. Listen, you only a police officer doing your eight to five. Twenty four seven. Twenty four. This badge right that, here. This badge after, right after here. Twenty four seven. My bottom. You my bottom. No, bottom. sir. That, that's no, what nigga, I ain't nobody bottom, bottom nothing. Bottom nigga, I'm the number one. That better be the number one and only. Talking about a bottom bar. What? Yeah, you, yeah, you, you got bottom. me fucked up in the game. Yeah. But anyway, I got to go to work. I got uh, um 100 damn people on my calendar. I can't be fooling with you. Yeah, yeah. bottom nothing. Okay, like so, so, so go ahead and answer that for, for your husband while you're standing here. Don't worry about the side of the car with the doors. Yeah, right? don't worry about the side door. I'm going to call you in a minute. <laughs> How are you busy? <laughs> yeah. What's going to be done <laughs> Anyway, that yeah. just like you said, don't worry about what you see, what you saw, or nothing. As long so, as you so, the hey, bottom. So, so again, that's it. You, I, I was telling them, yeah, yeah. So like I was telling you earlier, me and you, we got this thing. If I don't tap you on the shoulders, I didn't see you, right? <laughs> that's bullshit, nigga. We married. That's for them motherfuckers in the street. Try it if you want to. You yeah. thought your tooth was missing? Don't come hey. up missing. Hey. What the fuck? You got me fucked yeah, up, man. Don't understand. come up, mister. A bag or a bop. Yeah. Understand. A bag or a bop. If you don't tap me on the if you don't tap me on the shoulders, it wasn't me, man. 
Period. Okay, again, a bag or a box. Yeah, like I said, if you don't tap me on the shoulders, it wasn't. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, that go both ways, right? I told you that. Listen. Oh, okay. Well, shit, let's go. I ain't never been in your emails. I ain't never been in your inbox. I ain't never been in your DM. Yes, yeah. Come, yes, on, Come on, Queen. Knock it off. You know, I don't yeah. even get it. I don't even. You may, you see, you been in there, but you probably ain't said now, but you not been in there. Well, that's the same thing. If I just, <laughs> I don't give a fuck. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I answer your phone. They be like, hey, man, let me holler at my girl. Hold on. Hey, Queen, you do it on the phone, man. Keep it short and sweet. You know what I'm saying? Let the nigga know I'm sleeping. You feel what I'm Ooh, saying? Yeah. Stop but, it. Stop it. You know you man, I wish the nigga would have caught my phone. You talking about stay asleep. You know you'll nut the fuck up. Yeah, you choke your ass, clean the fuck out, like I told you. <laughs> but all I tell you is don't get caught, man. You you can do everything you want to do. You got as many boyfriends as you have, and when you get caught, what's gonna happen? D E A nigga dead, nigga. I want to be dead. You is be you dead? dead? Nigga, you ain't ever caught me doing shit. Don't come up missing. <laughs> Yeah, you ain't never caught me doing shit, man. Hey, Jersey. Yeah, that part right there, man. Anyway, so you like the money say a bag on box. So you ain't gonna tell your home. Girl, I, right? Don't be make me a widow at forty five. Listen, I already know you got the little half a million dollar life insurance policy. You and your nigga ain't finna ride off on me, nigga. I'm gonna get a nigga gonna ride off on blue. You got me fucked up, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's already the word and already put out, man. If you see, yeah, we. After I'm going, nigga. Hey sis, hey Josie. I got nigga, it. I, we gonna ride out on blue. We gonna relocate and everything. Okay. We already got a plan. That's what you are gonna have to do is relocate. That's we are, we gonna relocate to LA. We going straight to your spot. Hey, you we gonna go move. <laughs> hey man, get your ass off my phone, man. Yeah, what that bullshit talking about? They gonna go to LA, man. Hey Jers, where you at, man? Let me get Jers. Hey, let me get Bobby on here, man. Bobby Boucher, what up, man? Get on there for me one time, Bob. I got. I'm gonna ask you the question, man. We on a good one today, man. Hey, they don't let Queen get y'all food, man. Trust me, I run shit, man. Period. Come on on here, Hot Beasy. I mean, Bobby, Bo Bobby, come on on here, man. Yeah, she ain't right. Hey, man. Hey, look. Hey, hey you know what? To hey, fuck you, yard. Yeah. I'm going to ask Josie, man. Hey, I told you. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> I told you. Bobby, let me get, all right, let me get my sister Josie on here. Josie, can you come on camera real quick or are you working? Josie's probably working. Josie's probably working. Yeah, that's the RT. I can, I can imagine what the SS runs. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah. It got a nice size trunk. It ain't no real big trunk. But Josie, you can't come on either. You working out? Y'all killing me this morning, Cell. You know if she come to LA, we got that. I, that's what I'm talking about. Hey, country, I already know. Man, my niggas ain't going out like that. Man, you got my niggas fucked up, man. You feel me? Anyway, man, that's my time. I love y'all. That was the topic today. Stay loyal. Tell your friend to mind your business, man. It is what it is. Oh, you like that? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna ask you. Your sister come to a bike party, meet a nigga on the set. Okay. The nigga she meets, she call you, say, "Hey, I really love this nigga." You know what about him? You gonna tell her? You gonna mind your business? Or you gonna tell your sister he ain't shit? If it's my sister? Yeah. My blood sister? Yeah. That nigga ain't shit. Leave him the fuck alone. Yeah. If he ain't shit. Yeah. What about, I, don't, I don't mind my business with, 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 when it comes to my family. Yeah. No, because at the end of the day, if a nigga touch my sister, I'm going to kill you. Yeah. I don't give a fuck who you are. So, my, but my, my plus is to tell you, I don't go to clubs with them. I don't do nothing no, with them. No, me neither. That's what I'm saying. I don't do that yeah. shit. You because can't hang out with them. Yeah, if one of these dudes fuck around and do something wrong, yeah. then we're going to have a problem. All right, so. So it keeps me out of trouble. So, let me ask you this. Yeah. Somebody that you cool with, been cool with for years, you feel what I'm saying? Cool with on, on a bike set or cool like in No, no like, you know, off the bike set. Okay. But they meet a they meet a nigga on the bike set that they date that they like and they dig it. Like, hey, what you know about so and so? What you do? Mind your business. Hey, it is that man. Yeah, that, that's totally different. Yeah, but sisters nah, is off limits. Hell no, family's off limits. <laughs> I, ain't, I don't even want to get involved in that. Like, I just mind my business. That's my sister business. What she doing over there? When the dude call her bitch, whatever, that's y'all yeah. business. I don't yeah. want no nothing. <laughs> if, if he hit you, it, as long as you don't tell, big bro. Yeah. 
Because I got caught up in that. Yeah. I, I got I got I got in a situation with that. Yeah. Yeah. That that happened in real life. Something happened to my sister when it came to me. Then when I did something to the boyfriend. And the then why you, yeah. why you do that? Why you do that? <laughs> <laughs> I was I'm just with you. This is gonna turn me in. <laughs> Again, man. Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, man. What, why you feeling, man? Did you said these folks see about this Hemi over here, man? You hey, got man. To, like, nah, don't do that, man. Hey, don't that. They already him. hate you. Man. Hey, man. I told you that, but hey. hey. Oh, you know what? I'm glad you. I'm glad you converted to Dodge. Hey, yeah, my bad. Cause you know, uh, yeah. Hey, hey man. man. Look here, man. That Dodge motherfucker. ain't no joke. Man. I might have to get that motherfucker back here. That motherfucker gonna get a nigga smooth in trouble, man. Hey. Anytime you look up and you doing 120 and and you ain't even actually doing 120. Yeah. I tell them, love yeah. worth the money. Yeah. Now, now the resale value ain't shit. <laughs> I would be like Oprah. He ain't shit. He ain't shit. Look at Anthony. Hey, T. Rob, you get on here. There. Let me get on T. Rob, man. I'm gonna get you after this. I'm gonna let y'all go, man. T. Rob, where you at, man? You supposed to be? I ain't no telling what part of the country you in. I told you, I'm gonna have to go and take, put your damn bike on the flat. Cause you be riding too goddamn much. You trying to get it in, man? Ever since you done joined Rare Bree. T. Rob, what's up, baby? What it do, baby? What it do? Say, man, mind your business. Be your friend's friend. You feel what I'm saying? Or, or stick to the man code. What, or, or, you know what I'm talking about? What you going to do? Stick to the man code and mind your business or tell your friend. What you going to do? Man, for friends, I mind my business. I follow your rule. If you ain't tapping me on the shoulder, you ain't seen me. Yeah, exactly. So, so you see Queen out somewhere with another nigga. You my partner now. But I think you've been doing Queen longer than me. So you see Queen out somewhere with another nigga hugging and kissing. Do you call me or you don't call me? No, I snatch Queen ass up, put her in the car. <laughs> <laughs> you going home. <laughs> you explain the big sale where your car at. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, that part. I, I appreciate that. I, mean, Obi, I appreciate that, bro. I'm for real, though. You know what I'm talking about? Hey man, it's a it's a thin line, man. I think right. in this conversation, it's just a thin line, man, between minding your business and being somebody's friend. And uh, you know, sticking to the man code. So that's what we was talking about, man. So for you, if if for you, if one of your homeboys is dating somebody that you know ain't right, do you tell the homeboy or you let him figure it out on his on his own? I mind my business because a lot of times, you know, at a point in a person's life, they might have changed. They might be ready to settle down. It might be that person. No, but you know something about it. I mean, you know something. Let's say, let's just say the, the girl is married. And, you know, she, she, you know, your homeboy don't know she married. Do you tell your homeboy she married or you just let, you know, you mind your business? I kind of, I mind my business, but I drop some hints like, you been to her house? <laughs> <laughs> so you ain't going to tell, you ain't going to just say that, you going to kind of like, you, 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 you going to kind of drop snitch a little bit, huh? Huh? That, that's right. I'm gonna dry snitch, give us some little bit of crackers, you know, break the crack off, give them a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> man, my man T Rob, man. My man T Rob, crazy hell, man. Well, there it is there, man. T Rob say, hey, Queen, if T Rob see y'all, he gonna kick that yeah. So when he drop you off, I ain't gonna even ask no question. I'm gonna just pick you on up, just take you on in the house. You, <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? And tell you, yeah, you done got caught, huh? T Rob, hey. your ass out, man. <laughs> hey. Huh? Hey, you come up with the story. I'm just gonna nod my head. <laughs> All right. Hey, y'all, let me bring y'all on here, because y'all got, hey, y'all, I already know y'all, you ain't going to tell a nigga shit, man. I don't know, man. I don't know, y'all, you might tell a motherfucker. You might tell a motherfucker, man. You said, fuck it. Y'all. So, y'all. What up, man? So, so. What's going on? So, you catch Queen out fucking with another nigga, man. You catch the Queen out fucking with another nigga. What do you do? You call and tell me, or you just mind your business? Oh, no, it's just like my big brother T-Rob just said. Queen ass going in a chokehold in the car into the house. <laughs> he going in a chokehold into the house? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. That's what she going to do, huh? Hey. Yeah. Hey, that's the only way to roll. I mean, and I'm being honest, that's just like with you. I'm going to walk up and tap you on your shoulder and be like, Sal, come talk to me for a minute, bro. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What the hell are you out here doing? <laughs> that what you gonna do? Oh man, most deaf. 
Well, I mean, there it is there. If that's what it is, that's what it is. If that's what it is, that's what it is, man. But yeah. now, any average old Joe off the street, and they come to me about, hey, man, what about Linda over here? Oh, bro, I, I don't know. Like I said, I think she got three kids. She drive a Malibu, and that nigga work over at the damn free clinic. That's all I can tell you. Damn, Trey Slaughter said, Trey Swell said he caught a tip to murder behind his sister, man. You feel what I'm saying? Hey, I feel it. Hey. Well, look here, bro. I love you, man. Appreciate you this morning, man. You know what I'm talking about? My boss. Get it in, bro. I got to get to work, man. Hey, I love y'all, man. I'm going to go. Hey, let me go in this. So, anyway, that's what it was this morning, man. I hope y'all learned something. I love y'all. Truly, I do. But listen, you ain't got to worry about telling Queen, telling me about Queen, man. I'm good, man. I'm happy and I'm satisfied. So, if she can handle it, because but if I catch her, you'll know about it. You ain't got to worry about it. When I catch Queen cheating, you'll know about it because I'll be locked up in jail. Damn you know what I'm saying? Man. Murder, sodomy, hey, all hey, kind of shit. It ain't that serious. Yeah, that's, that's serious for me. It is? Oh, yeah. You ain't finna embarrass me, nigga. I got too much invested, nigga. No, I don't worry about that. Don't worry about it? Let, just let it be? Yeah. Mm, okay. Sure. The other dude she messing with might, uh, might be paying your bills. Might, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. I mean, what's she supposed to tell me at the front, though? We playing the game. Yeah. If we playing the game, if that's who he is, that's his role. Say, yeah. baby, look here, man. You know what I'm saying? This is what I'm doing. And... Right, baby, you, know, you know that new car you got outside? Yeah, okay. Stop, appreciate it. Stop complaining. Okay, well, no. You're supposed to tell me that beforehand. See, after the fact. So, it's, so, so you don't work off emotions? Yeah. See, if you come to me and say, hey, babe, look, I got to do this. What he doing? He just dropped boo. Okay, babe, how you been? Make sure you, 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 you got, you know, get your hours and shit straight. <laughs> uh, that's how we're going to do it, man. You feel what I'm saying? What's going on, man? Oh, man. But anyway, I'm going to let y'all go. Yeah, do your thing, man. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah. Hey, man. Hey, what up with us, uh, Flacco, man? We just here, man. Getting the, um, we're at the shop, man. We're trying to do some big things, man. But anyway, man, I love y'all. Y'all be good, man. Peace.